Good morning, welcome to my laboratory. What you're looking at there, uh, you might recognize the top waveform as being a characteristic drain or waveform from the MHOP. Uh, the bottom looks a little strange because this is the rotorless version of the mile high op amp driver motor. As you can see, I've got the rotor removed and I've just got the sense coil positioned near the drive coil and I've adjusted the um, the uh, uh, threshold potentiometer there appropriately and we've got a, a current of 110 milliamps 25.3 voltage uh, input and uh, that's what the spike looks like and we have the uh, the run neon glowing quite well as, as you can also tell from the waveform there with those beautiful spikes. The top waveform is at 50 volts per division and the top of the spike goes up to 400 volts way off the top of the screen um, Okay, and uh, just to show that the uh, uh, thing is doing whatever it was doing before. Once again I have the little ring oscillator here so we'll put this to the power takeoff terminal. And as you can see it charges very very rapidly. Uh, more rapidly than it did when the motor was, when the rotor was on there rotorating. Because we're not wasting power turning a rotor now. We are just uh, directly triggering the um, op amp with the magnetic field of the drive coil through the sense coil and so what you're seeing here is a classic feedback situation um, positive feedback and the flipping of the comparator is fast enough to produce a good uh, cutoff spike which can then be siphoned off in the usual manner to power external devices, charge external capacitors, or do whatever you like with it. Alright, thank you for watching the rotorless M-Hop.